Well, good morning, it's Crazy Cheap Chick. And tonight we are having meatball subs and a pasta salad. Now this meal is a super simple summer delight. <laughs> and you're gonna love it, so let's get cooking. Cut up some vegetables and added in a few tomatoes, tossed them in olive oil. Now I'm just gonna add a little bit of um, Italian seasonings, whatever kind you want. I'm using basil, oregano, and I think I'll put some rosemary on there. Could put thyme, a little salt and pepper if you wanted, but I'm trying to cut back on salt myself. And now I'm gonna take these meatballs that I got for $3.99 on sale last week, and I'm gonna make them about half that size. Now that I have those meatballs about half their size, I am gonna cook them. And um, I just divided them in half, made them a little bit smaller, and I'm gonna cook them in a little olive oil and garlic. Got some water out because we're also gonna make a little pasta to go with it. I'm gonna toss the pasta with these roasted vegetables, of course. Now we're about to get through this whole package of sausage rolls and I'm gonna um, kind of lightly grill them and then we will melt a little provolone cheese on top. Of course, once the meatballs are cooked a little bit more, I'm going to put a little bit of pasta sauce in there, just a red gravy. And that's what it's going to be. It's going to be a roll with provolone cheese and meatballs on a toasted bun. I mean, it doesn't get much easier than that. Now, neither does this pasta salad. Pretty easy, but really delicious meal, I think. You want to make sure you're constantly turning those so they don't get burnt. I mean, these aren't burnt. They're just, they're going to be delicious. Now that those meatballs are pretty well cooked, I mean, they're like 90% cooked, I'm going to go ahead and add in some pasta sauce. I don't want to add a ton, and I'm just going to heat this up on low, maybe like on two. And, uh, is going to be for our meatball subs. We just want it to be warm and ready to go on the bun. And now that the buns are toasted, I'm going to put some provolone on the buns and toast them, you know, kind of like they do at Subway. I always use two slices of cheese per sandwich. I suppose that's a lot of calories, but it sure tastes good. And while the um, Vegetables are roasting. I'm gonna go ahead and make a little dressing for the pasta salad. I make a little dressing for this pasta, and it's just gonna be olive oil. And this is like homemade suddenly salad. Only you don't need to buy suddenly salad. You can make this easy enough yourself. And a little bit of vinegar. Use whatever kind of vinegar you want. You don't need very much though. You don't want it too vinegary. I do like rice vinegar because it's a little bit sweet. And I put in just a little bit of honey. Not a lot. Let's stir that up. Put a little bit of seasonal in there as well. Uh, we've got seasonal on the vegetables, so I don't know that we need a whole ton in here. Man, that's almost perfect. Just a little dry though. Just a little bit more olive oil. Add a bit more honey, not very much. That's funny. And a tad bit more vinegar. And it's just because it's too dry. I've got it seasoned well, a little bit more. Like I said, the vegetables have season all on them also. You know, one thing about saving money is just eat everything. I mean, my husband always says, I don't care how much you spend on groceries as long as we eat it all. And so these are some olives that I had left over from a dish the other night. And so I'm going to go ahead and put them in this salad. They'll be good in there. And don't walk away while that cheese is melting. Got that cheese nice and bubbly. And now we're just going to put some meatballs on our sub. I'm not going to probably need all these meatballs, so we'll have some left for lunch tomorrow. Oh, doesn't that look good? Meatball sub? Now I just gotta finish this salad real quick. 
There's our roasted vegetables. And we're just gonna scoop some out and put them in the salad. And you can, you know, char them to the extent that you want. Not everyone wants them overly done. Now that's a pretty good suddenly salad type pasta dish. But we're gonna jazz it up just a little bit more by adding some Parmesan cheese. If you don't like Parmesan cheese, of course, leave it out. <laughs> now I tasted the dressing, and oh man, that's good. And there you have it, meatballs up with pasta salad. Yummy, it doesn't get better than that. Well guys, that meal was delicious. <laughs> There's a reason I'm overweight. <laughs> um, thank you so much for watching. If you got anything out of the video, give me a thumbs up, a like, share, comment, or subscribe. I would love it if you would join our community. Uh, have a great rest of your day.